hello what's up guys today i am going to teach you how to show the output voltage and frequency response of the active bandpass filter it is the circuit of bandpass filter of first order please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for getting the latest update first i am going to teach you how to check the output voltage uh, at the output of the active bandpass filter for checking the output voltage place the oscilloscope at the output of this circuit go to the virtual instrument and then select the oscilloscope place here and connect the wire to channel a and if you want to see the input uh, voltage of this graph uh, then you should connect the input of this graph to the oscilloscope scope here i am connecting and run this circuit here you can see uh, the input is showing in uh, channel b here you can see but the output is not uh, showing uh, at this time you should change the setting for showing the output graph uh, of this uh, first order bandpass filter here you can see graph is uh, just going towards changing here you can expand or extract the graph set the position from here as you can see i connect the output of this circuit to the channel a here is the graph of channel a Uh, here you can see this graph is covering only one box uh, and uh, here is uh, and here is 2 millivolt you can follow my cursor here is 2 millivolt and here is graph covering only uh, only one box uh, if you want to calculate the out output voltage then you should multiply 2 millivolt with the uh, signal covered box here you can see 2 millivolt and uh, signal covering only one box so i multiply 2 millivolt with 1 and and the output of this graph is 2 millivolt here is the graph of input of this circuit here you can see the input of this graph is covering uh, two boxes and you can see here in channel b in uh, channel b uh, here is prob is at 5 volt you can follow my cursor here is a 5 volt and here is a uh, 2 volt uh, sorry here is a two boxes so i multiply 2 with 5 here is 5 here is 5 volt and here is two box uh, two boxes and uh, here is signal is covering two boxes so if we want to calculate the input voltage then i then i multiply 5 with 2 then the input voltage is 10 volt and secondly i am going to teach you how to show the frequency response of the first order active bandpass filter for this purpose delete this oscilloscope from here and uh, stop this circuit and uh, delete uh, this oscilloscope from here and uh, go to the graphs icon you can follow my cursor and select the frequency here is already automatic selected is frequency and again click here 
and uh, here uh, you can draw this uh, frequency graph box to show the frequency response of the active band pass filter uh, you should connect the voltage prop to the output here i am connecting voltage prop here you can see voltage prop select and connect to the output here you can change any name i am changing v out Uh, drag this voltage prop from here into the frequency response graph and also uh, drag the input of this circuit to the frequency response graph and uh, then press uh, the space button uh, here you can see the graph of uh, active band pass filter you can change the setting of the frequency starting frequency and uh, uh, end frequency uh, by double clicking on the graph i am just double clicking clicking on the graph here i am selecting uh, 400 hertz as starting frequency and here i am i am selecting 4 kilohertz is a stopping frequency here you can change any value of frequency of uh, start frequency of and uh, stop frequency and then press uh, okay and then press again the space button here you can see the graph uh, of uh, graph of uh, active band pass filter from 400 to 4k hertz i am just uh, expand this graph here you can see it is starting before 500 from 400 and it is ended at uh, 4 kilohertz here you can see it is it is at uh, 4 kilohertz Thanks for watching this video and never forget to subscribe my YouTube channel for getting the latest update. Thank you.